I'm from Afghanistan originally, but I live in Norway, so this is the first time I've, I am here in Ethiopia. So it's beautiful here so far. It's amazing. Very, very different culture here than uh, that I'm used to here. So, yeah, I'm with him. He's a Roma, <laughs> so he's, he's my friend. He told me that he wanted to, you know, uh, take me here and celebrate Eretia together. Yeah, this is my first time here. So far, it's amazing. This part is a huge experience, a huge experience. They are so colorful, they are so peaceful, they are so friendly. The people, they are be in connect with each other. You feel really, really safe and uh, being loved in this place. Come and join Ethiopia with the Eretia celebration. It's amazing. People will love it, everybody will love it. Yes, so yeah, before half years, mm -hmm. yes, I come here as on the April. Okay. Yes, I come here is for work. Okay. Yes, yes, I work at the ZT Corporation. Yes, and uh, I cooperate with uh, the Astro Telecom. The first time to take part in the celebration, uh, I think it's very nice. Yeah, we can, so the many people come from other city, uh, come to Yadis Abeba, your cap capital to celebrate uh, the festival, then mm -hmm. it's uh, very nice. My name is Jana and I'm from Sweden. It's very fun to be a part of it here. It's um, great to see so many people come out and also it's fun to see like all the different people from the different um, parts of Oromia. It's a really beautiful celebration. I love seeing so many people come out to celebrate together and the unity and togetherness, it's really great to see. <laughs> Hello, Namaste Oromia, Namaste Ethiopia, Namaste Africa. Uh, happy Oromia, uh, Erita, right? Uh, everything good, amazing, beautiful culture, beautiful, lovely people. Everything amazing. Everything amazing. People's environment, our festival, our dress off, everything, everything amazing. Thank you so much. We've been preparing to come here for a number of weeks um, and we have heard all about Eritrea and what's happened in Bishoftu and in Addis and we went visited Addis yesterday and we've been here in Bishoftu this morning and it's an amazing feeling. I mean such a display of music and dance and colour and culture. Uh, we absolutely love it. I mean, I would recommend anybody to do this from Ireland. They should come here and do this. This place is our first time visit. So I think uh, most of the people here are enjoying the day. Uh, we also enjoying the day. We love the uh, people. We love the, this festival. We are enjoying. Thank you. I'm really happy to be there. And uh, I like people. I like the... Yeah, all in Yeretsha. It's really nice. Dibayu lakini yetu sidhani kama itafika. Tunaomba ifike hapo. So ni mara ya pili. Mara ya kwanza walikuwa tumeanza makajana. Watu walikuwa wachache sana. Sasa hii ni mara ya pili. So hii dadi tumeona kupata sio raisi. Hii watu ni wengi sana. Tumefurahia sana. Na vile tunaona Irecha kuleta watu pamoja. Uh, I'm feel very blessed to have you here. I've seen beautiful attires, beautiful um, uh, human kinds. I, I will say human kinds, my brothers and sisters. And I saw the rituals there to home, to give a homage to the ancestor, to the God, to, the, to, to uh, respecting the agriculture. Right? Agriculture gives us the food. It's the main source for us. Without agriculture, without cultivation, without the environment, without the weather, we could not be a uh, living being. So it's, I'm very happy and very impressed. Thank you so much. I haven't experienced anything like it. I'm very much um, uh, trying to take in and soak in all the atmosphere, the music, the colour. Everyone's so joyful, so happy. It's really inclusive. It's incredibly welcoming. And uh, I think Aromia has got a little bit of my heart. The African Union should take a good example from here. If these people can be united this much with this love, what if the whole Africa is united? So this is like a wake-up call to other African nations, to other tribes, to other cultures, because this is one of the things we need uh, to uphold. Because as you know, after the colonization of Africa, most of our cultural uh, practices has shifted drastically uh, to the Western culture. Yeah.